Uh, this is where he's most vulnerable, and if either Doran or Pin gets a kill here, that post six is going to be a lot harder as well. Oh boy. And this is what you got to deal with when you're Kana, right? He's trying to weave in and out here of the minions, but the dive is not great, and they spot the Lee Sin coming in as well. So Peanut and Doran on the run here. Peanut will get slowed up by the barrel. Kana still getting in there, but nothing will amount of it. Really nicely done by Kana there to use his W to reduce the damage now, the return gank. Yeah, he's here. The flash comes in. The spear lands, and that is first blood. He's resetting the Raptors so that uh, his jungler has extra time to get on in here and Dread can't uh, just kill them all. That is so cool. We, we very rarely see that kind of play. But uh, Lahens and Wolf. He's way over, but Peter. Hey, trying to get on in there. Lahens, though, with the Eclipse, he will just flash away. It is double flash traded for just Peter's flash. Close so uh, <laughs> Kind of awkwardly standing. I don't think it would have mattered too much as Jovi. Oh, he's getting greedy for that ward, and he's going to pay the price for it. Is the damage is enough is the question, as one more Spirit Rush is not enough to get the kill. If I was no, Kana, I'd be feeling not very safe. Oh, saying I think Nautilus is on the bot side. Bot side? Lee Sin, not Nautilus. Nautilus isn't in this game. <laughs> Lee Sin was not bot. <laughs> and, yeah. You know what that was right there? That's, That's cooking, cooking value. value. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. absolutely. That's all we ask for. Uh-oh. Jovi is in trouble here as, oh, he's going to dodge that, and he gets out on the edge of the Realm Warp. You're on Vision. Uh, they see him. As the charm will land. And the hook will not, as the Lee Sin able to go in there. But you've just baited yourself this time around, as Peter is going to get caught. And this is just gentle. He's running on Tilt Spellbook. Yeah. <laughs> Where does he get the movement speed? I don't know. Oh, wow. Using the Gragas to get on top of Dread. But, uh, but they are also a necessity. Nongshim Red Force is very different from the previous oh. game. Is Ghost. Ghost over the wall just flashes on Ruler. He says, who's the better AD carry now? As he's even getting some damage. And another hook comes in from Peter. But as there is a lot of posturing around the second Drake here. As BDD, he's going to be 100 to 0 here. As down he goes. Four kills you are going to give over to Nongshim. The harder it's going to be just on the vision. So this is the easiest setup possible. Just as you mentioned, straight upon the zero. Well, in the middle, it helps that there is just so much enabling as Ruler is going on in there. The hook goes on to the Leona, but they have enough damage at this point to just blow up Lahens as well. No flash onto him as maybe even another kill were diving the turret. Pretty rough. Oh no. Yeah, kind of no body slam here. As the Dominus is available, just going to get on in there. The body slam does come up, but it does not matter. The as Dread is looking for a little bit of fun down here on the bottom side. As over the wall he goes, the flash comes in as the kick is there. The Q is there, avoids the chompers perfectly. Leona with Locket. Um, and, and Lord Dominix is a really good item. Yeah, all of, all of that lead just kind of going into a subpar item is not ideal. As a really nice setup here on the bottom side, though. They almost even got Ruler as the Q not quite able to land, but... At least for Gen G's sake, they are getting wins on the other side of the map. And Kana trying really nice interrupt on yeah, the E there. As Dread doing a little bit of geometry here. Will not get hit by any of these. Full circle. <laughs> yep, the, a big difference maker. So Ghost, you better collect some people. We'll see if he can uh, get some last hits. As he is going to cleanse that very nicely, but Peter not in the best spot here. Nongsim very aggressively positioned in the mid lane. They say, no, 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 we're we're ahead in this game, but I'm not so sure because they just got bodied. And, and the issue for Nongshim is that scaling is a relative term. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. Dread's going in. They're, they're looking for kills. Nongshim are like, let's set up a play. BDD was not here, and they were not ready to get the kills. And uh, very, very rushed. Genji immediately going to clap down on that uh, one. Nongshim trying to fight, as you pointed out, as if they are on even footing. You are not on even footing. And Dread, if you're earlier with that play, then maybe you can actually utilize the turret, but instead it's disaster. I, I think you could pretty much play anything. Five and Yordles, win. maybe, but not five Teemos. Jovi is, he is not losing health. <laughs> like, and Nongshim are still trying to set up plays. Doran's in your base! Doran is in your base, okay? Like, you're, you are not getting away from this. And nobody is going to kill Doran. You are right at the end of the day, Chronicler. He will live. 
And game number two is going to be quicker than game number one. Uh, well, Lahens might die here. Okay, he's got a stopwatch. <laughs> there you go. Best item in the game. They're just going to knock down these structures. Will they go for the end is the only question on their minds. And it looks like they will. And they have the ability to at this point. 12,000 gold the lead now for Genji at 22 minutes. I just want to remind, we haven't seen this Genji face off against T1 yet. And that's that's got to be what everyone's thinking about, right? Because this yeah. is such an insanely dominant performance. The confidence to just lock in the composition and then actually play it out. Two times in a row, Genji playing around the prior play, playing around the power beautifully. <laughs> they're, I, they're, they're not going to end here, <laughs> right? I think that's the right call, honestly. Oh, like, wow. Don't Teleport. Wait. Nongshim trying to speed this Wait. one up. They're trying to go home as fast as possible. Okay, nice charm onto Jovi. You did about 10, 10 damage there. No! Nicely done as the croc. This time, he's in his natural habitat. This game is over, guys. Not much else to say about this one. Gen G will close the door in 23 and a half minutes. And I wasn't joking when I said Nongshim, we're trying to end this one as soon as possible. It has been painful. They have been bullied. But that's what happens sometimes. 14,000 gold to lead. Genji will smack him down once again. Rise composition, so. Uh, not, not the right place, but I think understandable. As we will listen in. Say, let's go. <laughs> Awkward cat emoji. Doran's like, no, guys, uh, what are you doing? I want to end. So good. <laughs> Ruler is very happy. Ha, ha, ha.